We are in historic Reisterstown in northern Baltimore County. And it's where on Main Street you'll find the new home of the Maryland Horse Breeders Association. They bought the building last June and are now getting ready to create a library and education center inside that will detail the state's rich horse history. We're going to have books and videos and access to history and looking forward in the horse industry, what, what careers might be available. The middle jewel of the Triple Crown is just weeks away, the Preakness in Baltimore, but racing is only one small part of the horse industry in Maryland. It goes back for centuries and we have currently 100,000 horses in Maryland, more horses per square mile than any other U.S. state. Different disciplines from polo to dressage to barrel racing. We have the world champion uh, junior bull riding champion. He also rides horses from Upper Marlboro. We have a little bit of everything here in Maryland and what we have is very high quality. The Library and Education Center is being built thanks to fundraising from the Maryland Horse Foundation. It's expected to be a one-stop destination to learn pretty much everything you'd ever want to know about horses in Maryland. For general public, people that may know nothing, all the way to people that know a whole lot about the horse industry. And they may be in here researching a book or doing a video or, um, you know, it's just going to be a wide range of people. We want it to appeal to everybody. Renovations on the new library and education center are set to begin this summer, and the hope is that it will be open by Preakness of next year. In Baltimore, Jennifer Franciotti, WBAL-TV 11 News.